Hey, I'm here in Anaheim, California at the Barbershop Harmony Society International Convention and Contest. Basically, barbershop quartets come from all over the world to compete here. It's very exciting. It's one of those rare competitions where there are no winners, only losers. I'm talking to Rick Spencer. You are the director of operations yes. here at the Barbershop Harmony Society. Is that That's correct? Right. Yep. There's a lot of excitement yep. out there right now. What's happening? Another quartet's coming on stage. Well, it must be a pretty big group that's getting that kind of reaction. This group is actually from England. They traveled all the way from England to uh, compete this year. I don't like people from England coming over to our country. We invented it. We invented this. <laughs> I'm standing here with OC Times. You guys rocked this thing last year. You walked away with the top prize, is that correct? Yes, yeah. it is. Just remember till you're home again. And I'm told that you just became complete a-holes afterwards. <laughs> You've recovered now, you're yep. humble again, Clean. and you're about to come out with your second album. Yes, yes. Right? Yeah. Called F Dat Bitch Up. <laughs> <laughs> There are two versions of this patch. One just says Barbershop Harmony Society, and uh, the other says, please don't have sex with me. <laughs> Hi, Geraldine, how are you? I'm doing well. You're selling everything at this table? I am. Tell me about this pitch pipe. Every barbershopper carries one of these. And then what are you selling here? These are the holders. Snap it on your belt. Oh, wow. <laughs> it has to be accessible. How do you not get beat up if you're a guy wearing a pitch pipe holder? Well, these conventions is not going to happen. Yeah, it's not going to happen at this convention. Not happen. The minute you leave this convention with this baby strapped on, mm, you're my pitch pipe holder. No. It fixed no. firmly to my belt. No. I'm going to buy seven of these, and I'm going to put them all that's around. Good for me. Yeah, like right here in the middle, it's a little, that's a little too racy, right? Might be, yes. That's kind of racy. <laughs> it could get racier. I could just clip that on there. You are the harmonious hunks. It's true. Standing all together, you look like a 1959 Chrysler. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're not true. That's good. I've been accused of that by myself. No, no, no. <laughs> so how did you all meet? Did you all just walk into a restaurant and you were wearing the exact same suit? Yep. And you that's thought, we've got to start yeah. singing together? Yeah, My biggest disappointment is people don't have the... The handlebar mustaches. The, the handlebar some, mustaches. They're they're right. They don't have the yeah. striped vests. Yeah. Yeah. That's hats. what I came for. And the straw hats. Yeah. That's what I came for. Don't forget the garters. Yeah, the yeah. arm garters. Yeah, you're out of luck. You know, I see these kids walking around with their backwards baseball caps, yeah. you know, trying to throw down on some sweet Adeline, and I'm not having it. really <laughs> sweet Isn't this a sexy look? Yes, yes. And the barber told me. This is my great great grandfather used to sing this in Barbershop Quartet. It's one of the classics. You want to hear it? Yes. Welcome to the jungle. We've got fun and games. We got everything you want. Welcome to the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. Remember that one? No, you sound just like Mork. Mork? I'm standing here with Alan Gasper, one of the judges. Alan, what do you think? You look great. Sweet Adeline. Has your mustache ever brushed against another guy's mustache while you were singing and you got embarrassed for a second? It happened that one time. No, it didn't. I, I, won't, tell, I won't tell anyone. I Honest on I would never do that. I would never talk about that on TV. I'm just curious, what got you interested in singing? Well, um... My uncle actually got me into barbershop. He was a singer, a barbershop singer. I resisted at first. It was just a bunch of old farts, and I didn't want to. Sing right, you didn't want to do it. But then when I actually. Showed but then up, when the beard was... came in, you thought, I have yeah, I to thought, do it now. Is that or become a whaling captain? Yeah. What do you guys all do for fun, if you know what I mean, when the singing is done? We sing. Oh. Some more. Yeah. Okay, so we had a great ending to this piece. Uh, where I ride off into the sunset on this old-timey, turn-of-the-century bicycle that uh, we rented for a lot of money. But just before shooting, it fell apart. I can't believe it. It's a piece of crap. And I'm not going to pay for the rental.